ideal food for Uncle Joe. Are you ready? Okay. Breakfast, two eggs sunny side up, two, two, three, four, five pieces of white bread with heavy duty <laughs> butter on those motherfuckers. Three, four pieces of bacon and some potatoes fried to the max with Frank's hot sauce on it. Oh, nice. All right? And some juice and maybe a can or two of Coca-Cola. All right? Fucking lunch. I got to do pork fried rice, heavy duty, shrimp and lobster sauce, two egg rolls, a couple appetizers, and fucking three or four cans of Coke. That, that's <laughs> life right there. With, with Maybe at the end, a glass of water just to clean out the digestive tract. The first snack of the day... What the f- a salami and American cheese sandwich on white with mustard. What kind of mustard? Yellow. White people mustard. American <laughs> yellow. The bland shit. No, you don't even need the spicy mustard. For dinner, maybe six or seven fried chicken cutlets breaded with mashed potatoes with fucking tons of butter in it, salt and pepper, some cream corn, and some fucking cranberry juice with some club soda over ice cubes. You understand me going deep. Then after you get home at night, my night, I, this is what I could settle for. This is my ideal day. A nice thin vanilla shake at night right before you hit the crib like a doctor with some fucking Briar's ice cream with the black little dots in it. Mm-hmm. But the truth, my late night de- de- dish, open steak sandwich on white bread with a little butter on the bread with the gravy from the steak dripping on the bread over motherfucking steak fries. You understand me? Oh. With a cream of turkey soup to open up and a milkshake on the way out. Oh, man. That's Uncle Joey's that's, fucking utopia right there. That's how that's you do my it. utopia. If I could find the bar <laughs> that would serve till two, because about two thirty is when I get the Irkin for a nice steak. Anybody could go to sleep with a fucking hot cocoa <laughs> or a fucking uh, what's the? Uh, let me get the tea, the gray poupon. Listen, bitch, <laughs> the in this fucking tea. house, we're doing a fucking T-bone. You know, I grew up in a Cuban house, and my mom would come home at three and go, "You hungry?" And within thirty minutes, there'd be a a four course fucking meal. You know, and you eat that shit, and there's only one way to go: is the bed. You eat one of those meals at three in the morning. There ain't no fucking exercise and. Or burning glycogen or nothing. <laughs> You're hitting glycogen after that one pull of the fucking helmet. Because <laughs> you a good whacking off after a good meal late night. Like at four in the morning, you close that door, wait till your mom closes her door. You put that little lock on your door and take that Playboy out and you beat that dick up for 20 minutes and shit. You get that little diabetic rush and shit. It's all over. 